Yo, what's up? It's your boy Marwin. We're making another banging dish. This time it's a holiday favorite in black households. Fried dish, candy yams. Let's get to cooking. We're making my version of candy yams. In actuality, the candy sweet potatoes, but that's a story for another day. You're gonna love these. They got a lot of spice, um, which adds a lot of complexity and flavor to the dish. A lot of depth. Um, the syrup is, is crazy good. Um, we've added some, some bourbon whiskey and some orange juice to kind of you know bring out some of those flavors even more. So let's just get to, let's just jump right into it. Yeah, the key to making a good candy yams recipe is starting with your syrup. So for me, it's boiling water with uh, pilo silo, which is a Mexican sweetener, similar to a combination of brown sugar and maple. I let it cook fully, disintegrating the, the pilo silo. And then I start to make the rest of the syrup by toasting my spices. I got cinnamon sticks, cloves, star anise, uh, and then I'm gonna add about a stick of butter and let those toasted spices with their more intense flavor infuse the butter before adding the liquid base back into uh, that mixture. So that's just the water and the pilo silo that's been melted. Uh, I let that cook to, a, to my desired consistency. Then I do a shot of whiskey for myself, a shot of whiskey for the syrup, let it cook to that thickness that I want. And while I do that, I'm adding a little bit of fresh orange juice to brighten it up a little bit. As you can see, it's st starting to reduce. I got a thick syrup. I'm gonna add it on all of my sweet potatoes. Then I'm gonna mix it up together, add more syrup, mix a little more, then add more syrup, making sure I got all of those rounds covered fully with the syrup. I'm baking at about 400 degrees, so I got the oven preheated. I'm gonna cover it up with foil, put it in the oven for 45 minutes, bring it back out, take the foil off, add more syrup if I need to, just take it a look, you know, give it the eye test. For me, yeah, I want this big bad boy sweet. I'm going back in the oven uncovered for another 30 minutes. Let that syrup, you know, really started to mess with the sweet potatoes. You take a look, check it out. You see a nice caramelization. Me, like I said, these are candy yams. So, hey, if it's candy yams, I need more syrup, more sweetener. And you can see it. Now I'm gonna give it the test, the, the texture test. For me, I want it to, to have some give, but I don't want it so uh, mushy right here. So it, it got a little bit of a response, you know, kind of texture to it. You can see it, it looks delicious. The the syrup and the potatoes are kind of like one all together. Give it a taste, check it out. Mmm, yep, 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 yes sir. I think uh, I'm in a good spot, that's it. Wow, this is a really, really good dish. I love the way the, the warm spices complement the sweet potatoes. I love the, the texture of the sweet potatoes. They're cut thick enough and cooked long enough so they're not too soggy. They absorb the, they absorb the syrup without being soggy, which is, you know, a feat in itself. I think you're gonna love it. Make the recipe, let me know what you think. If you like it, give it a like, leave a comment, but most importantly, don't forget to hit that red subscribe button. You get updated recipes every time I post a new one. Peace out.